Welcome to this special report on COVID-19, brought to you by CNA-TV. Welcome to the NACA COVID-19 report. I'm your host, Dane Henning. 70% of employees and up to half of patients found to be infected with COVID-19 at nursing home giant HCR Manor Care were asymptomatic at the time, says the chain's medical director. The novel coronavirus is, quote, the silent killer which we've learned so much about but still have so much to learn, said HCR Manor Care Medical Director Mark Gloth, MD, on Tuesday. He continued, it is virtually impossible for us to keep it out of our facilities. In fact, we know it's highly likely we'll see it in our centers. Gloss said that nearly 1,500 positive cases of COVID-19 have been discovered by the 222 facility chain, which has a daily census of nearly 25,000. That mortality rate has been close to 15%. Fewer than half of the facilities have experienced a single case, but infection clusters have largely occurred in facilities that have triple or quad rooms or are in municipal areas with higher rates of infection. Quote, even when we have done full in-house testing for employees and patients, we have seen that up to 70% of our healthcare providers who have been tested as positive were completely asymptomatic, Gloss said. He continued, and anywhere from 30% to 50% of patients who were asymptomatic patients did not represent with any overt symptoms that would have suggested they had this deadly and daunting virus. This has happened despite heroic efforts of staff and the chain being at the forefront of preventative measures, such as restricted visitations, the use of telemedicine, and enhanced staffing and patient education. The skilled care facilities of ProMedica Health System also got a jump on cohorting the infected and those suspected of being infected with COVID-19. There have been about 400 individuals with successful recoveries from COVID-19. Despite successfully leveraging every possible source and donor, Cloth added that there isn't a day that goes by when they aren't concerned about when their supplies will dry up. Similarly, he said it is frustrating in states where the mandate is to test all personnel but not enough test kits are available. Cloth would love to see tests for everybody, but are only receiving about three to four kits at a time in many locations, but they need many more. He also said HCR Manor Care is able to get about 10% of what they really need when it comes to test kits. Gowns remain the biggest PPE difficulty to get. Quote, we have employees that are literally rushing in to help patients, but not everyone is so fortunate. What we need now is not to have criticism, but support. We have healthcare heroes just as hospitals do. They need to be recognized for that, supported for that, and acknowledged. Thank you very much for joining us on this COVID-19 report, and we'll see you next time.